you might be in a situation where you need to get a federal apostille from the Department of State. And a lot of times, one of the most common documents you're gonna get apostilled at the federal level is a birth certificate. My name is Rufus, I'm a notary dude here in Los Angeles, California. I'm an apostille notary here in Los Angeles, California. I process a lot of both Secretary of State and Department of State apostilles. Now, if you're in a situation where you need to get a federal apostille in a document, you're probably gonna be moving to a foreign country or there's probably gonna be a foreign country that's involved somehow, either through work, um, through school, maybe you're getting married in that foreign country. That foreign country wants to make sure you are who you say you are. And a birth certificate is one of those most common documents that they're gonna require to be apostilled. Now, something interesting about this is, you can get a birth certificate apostilled through the Secretary of State in the state who issued the birth certificate. There's some countries like Taiwan like Thailand, that don't allow you to do it at the state level. They want you to go at the federal level in order to get it done. This right here is a California birth certificate that has been, been uh, apostilled both at the state and the federal level. Let's look at this here for a minute. So you, the very top there says United States of America, and it says Department of State, and then down here it has some wording, and it's signed down here by a couple individuals um, from the federal government. So if you're in a situation where you need to get a federal apostille, this is what it's going to look like. They have the grommet right here, and then you have the cover sheet here for the federal apostille. Now something interesting about, as far as getting it for Taiwan is, Taiwan's gonna require you first to get the apostille from the Secretary of State. So this gentleman um, was living in California. He was born in California. So I first had to go to the Secretary of State in Los Angeles to get the uh, to get the apostille done. This is what a California apostille looks like. So you see right there, State of California, Secretary of State. And you see the apostille right here in the uh, upper corner. This right here is the federal apostille. See, they put the grommet right here and it says Department of State. So this is Secretary of State. Department of State. Now with the California apostille, you can see right here how they stamp it. They stamp partially on the birth certificate itself and partially on the Secretary of State apostille. So if you've been told that you need to get a federal apostille for a document, especially a birth certificate, you need to call me. My name is Rufus. I'm the notary dude here in Los Angeles, California. I'll put my contact information below. So what is all involved with this? How do you go about doing it? How long does it take? What does it cost? So what I'm gonna need is the actual birth certificate itself. Whatever state issued that birth certificate, it has to be the original. You don't have to be living in that state to get the Secretary of State apostille completed for a birth certificate. You can just mail me the birth certificate. This gentleman here was actually, who had this done, was actually living in Utah and he sent it to me here in California. All he sent me was his birth certificate. Once I have that birth certificate, I can get the ball rolling. Typically, if it's a California birth certificate, California document, I can get the apostille just within one or two days. Um, it's very quick. Now, the federal apostille, we're talking up to 11 weeks. It can take up to 11 weeks to get one, so make sure time-wise, you're accounting for extra time to get the federal apostille. Again, my name is Rufus, I'm the Notary Dude. My contact information is below. If you have any questions regarding a state apostille or a Department of State apostille, call me. I'm happy to answer any questions you might have. Chances are, we don't have to meet up to do this. You can just mail me the document, um, the original document, and I can handle the rest for you. Just mail it back once it's all complete. So once again, contact information is below. Go to my bio, and you can see exactly some of the work that I've done. There's a link there to my Google business page, and see what some of my clients have done, what documents they've apostilled. I'd love to help you out. So once again, if you need to get a federal apostille for a document, give me a call.